Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to another video. So today I am on the RCFR team and today I will be showing you how to gain XP fast on the fire and rescue team this time. So yesterday I did a video on the DOT team and today I'm going to do a video on the fire team. So yeah, uh, first of all, uh, okay, so number one, respond to calls. I know that I've already said this yesterday and I'm going to say it today, but respond to calls. So a lot of the people who join the fire department team only use it to like play around with the ladder truck and uh, mess around the uh, glitch it and use some and use the ability of the massive fire vehicles to uh, block roads and troll on public servers. That's how you not earn XP. So if you want to actually earn XP, then you gotta respond to calls. So uh, it, uh, also if you wanna like if you wanna keep good roleplay, then you wanna respond to calls while sticking to your rules. Like you don't want like a ladder truck responding to a EMS call. And you don't want an ambulance responding to the biggest wildfire in the RLC. So yeah, you want to respond to calls and uh, basically like actually do the job on the fire department team instead of like only like uh, playing on the fire department team to troll around and use the ladder truck. So yeah, uh, just like I'm doing right now, I'm just responding this. Uh, so is this near the patient? Oh shoot, the thing is on the wrong side. Okay, so there we go. We just did his body, and now we can like do CPR, etc., etc. Uh, so you wanna just put him in the ambulance, then drop him off at the hospital. Okay, so just like this, we're arriving at the hospital, and my ambulance just ran out of gas, and I'm slowing down. Are you kidding me? Let's hope we make it to the emergency lane. Okay, so you just want to drop him off and you get XP. There you go. So number two, wear your gear. So I see a lot of people in public servers when they respond when they respond to fires, uh, they like just walk run into the house. Like uh, you, the main thing you need to do is wear a SCBA. A lot of people don't like to wear the SCBA because like. It is the uh, it's a helmet that glitches through their hair. It doesn't look good, but then they'll die because they have no protection inside the house. So the SCBA isn't only for roleplay purposes, but it's also for responding to fires and to protect your character. And you also have to make sure you're wearing the correct uh, uniform. So I've seen a lot of like people in EMS uniforms trying to respond and then uh, they die because they're just wearing a paramedic uniform or a lot of people like uh, they don't wear stuff so yeah just like over here so we arrived now if, now you wanna like actually access your compartment or do this in the station you can wear your SCBA doesn't mean you will need to wear your SCBA every all the time 24 7 you could only wear it once you're when if you're responding to calls but yeah so like if we walk up to this like flame per second you can see that I'm not getting damaged because I am wearing my SCBA and protection gear so that's not killing me from the fire and yeah so that's another way and number three then respond to civilian calls. So let's go ahead and stop this fire to stop the leg. Respond to civilian calls. So if, uh, uh, so a lot of the times when I call as a civilian in a public server and there's active people on the fire team, they never respond because like I'm just a civilian and like I'm not an actual like AI call or server call. So they think they don't get XP. But you can actually get XP for just responding to civilian calls. So like if a civilian gets shot and needs to be healed, even a firefighter can do that call and just heal them with their medic bag and they can get XP for doing that. Or like if someone's car catches fire, you could actually respond and put the car fire out and then heal the driver and that'll give you a lot of XP. And another thing is, the fire team, you actually get 45 XP per per fire that you put out, so that's a lot of XP. And uh, with the, uh, more XP comes promotions. 
and with promotions comes new vehicles new helmets and new tools and yeah basically like the reason you want to gain xp is because you want to basically uh, i don't know the reason you clicked on this video maybe you wanted to unlock a certain car or become a chief in a roleplay but yeah so that's really all there is on how to gain xp fast i hope this video was helpful uh, make sure to comment down below if you have any questions or want me to do more videos like this and i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you comment like and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time